Hey Steve, this is Samantha from Feed Me Leads. We spoke on the phone and I told you that I would send you over the screencast. And so here it is, I'm gonna keep it really short and sweet. I just wanna go through your site really quickly. I'm gonna go through one of your competitor sites. And then I'm gonna give you three ways that you could use today for free to start bringing in some more high quality traffic to your website. And so I send these screencasts out with all of this free information, but often when business owners see what I do, how I do it and how much work is put into it, they decide that they want to team up. So if you watch this through and you feel the same, please do not hesitate to reach out to me. But without further ado, let's get into it. And so here I am on the homepage of J&T Water Damage Services. And so I can tell that you guys spent some time or some money into this. The site looks very easy to navigate. Looks very professional. And I like how you guys have a blog. However, there is not a lot of content on here. And so Google is going to be ranking your website based off of around 200 different factors. One of those key factors is going to be content. You want to have a minimum of 1,500 to 2,000 words on this homepage. I did a word counter search and you guys currently have 776 words. So I would suggest adding in some more content here. You also want to make sure that content is quality educational content. Google is going to send out their bots and they are going to crawl through your site and determine whether or not the content on there will help Google's users find the information or the services that they are looking for. And in addition to having the right amount of content, you also wanna make sure that content is filled with the right amount of high volume buyer intent keywords. And so Google loves information and you can strategically place the right keywords in your content to tell Google exactly what terms you want your website to be in front of when people search for it. And so a great example of a keyword is Water Damage Restoration Anaheim. This keyword brings in 1,300 searches per month. So if you were to convert just a small fraction of those into customers, you would be doing really well for just one keyword. And so right beneath the search bar, we have our Google Ads. Google Ads are a really great way to get your name out there, build some brand recognition, particularly while you are waiting for your SEO to warm up, or you are looking for some quick gains and the market is hot. And so right beneath where the ads are, we have our Google Map Pack. The Google Map Pack is extremely important. It can produce huge amounts of revenue, especially if you make it into one of these top three spots. In order to do that, you need to have a lot of citations. And so a citation is just when your business is listed on an online directory. So Yelp, Yellow Pages, Yext, Angie's List, Home Advisor, those are all good examples of online directories that people use and trust a lot. And so you wanna be on more of those online directories than these three businesses are right here. Also, when you are entering your information into these directories, you need to make sure that all the information you're putting in matches the information on your Google business profile page. It needs to look absolutely identical down to every last character you put in. And so I've scrolled down and I've made it to the organic search results. This should definitely be your main area of focus. It's going to be your best long-term return on investment. Google has actually come out and said that over 70% of people, when they type something into the search bar, they are going to be clicking on one of these organic search results. And it's almost always going to be one towards the top of the first page. So this is the first company page that pops up for this keyword. And so as you scroll through, you can see they have a decent amount of content on here. I did a word counter search on them as well. They actually only have 1,005 words. So it would be easy to beat them out with the amount of content that they have. In order to rank organically, in addition to having good content, you need to have a lot of high powered relevant backlinks. And so a backlink is just a clickable text from one website to another. It's basically like one website giving a shout out to another website. And you want to get these shout outs or backlinks from high powered and relevant sites. So for example, if a local construction company with a powerful website were to give you a backlink, that would be a really great way to bring some more power to your site. So over here, I've hopped over to Arif's. Arif's is a really great tool. If you guys ever do bring this in-house, I highly recommend using it. It is a little pricey. It costs me around $350 a month to use, but it gives me a lot of great information. And so right here, I typed in the competitor that we were just looking at, and it's telling me that they have 613 backlinks from 148 different domains and are ranking organically for 1400 keywords. So I can click and see which keywords those are. We want to keep an eye out for buyer intent keywords that are preferably location specific. And so right here, 
It will list all the different keywords they're ranking for, how many people search for that keyword every month, what position they hold for that keyword on Google, and how much traffic it brings them. And so you can go through here, you can see which ones apply to what you do, and incorporate the best ones into your content. And so now I'm going to go back and I want to do the exact same thing that I just did with their keywords with their backlinks. And so it is saying that they have 613 backlinks. You don't want to just beat them out with the quantity of backlinks. You want to beat them out with the quality as well. So you can go through here and see which backlinks have a high DR domain rating. It'll say right here. So you want to go through and make sure that you get the best backlinks. You can click on each one and see if you can add your website to these links right here. You can go through these backlinks, other competitors' backlinks, find some on your own. And so right now it's saying that you they have 553 backlinks. That is definitely a beatable number, but do keep in mind that this is just one competitor for one keyword, and you want to be able to outrank all of your competition. And so over here, I have typed in your website into Arifs as well. Right now it's saying you guys have 49 backlinks from 12 different domains, and are you are ranking organically for 13 keywords. So let's see which keywords you are ranking for. So you do want to keep an eye out for buyer and 10 keywords. So right here, it seems like you have a couple of good ones you are going for. You're ranking somewhere on the sixth to seventh page. Other ones have your own name in them. So I would definitely broaden your scope and look for more keywords in more areas that bring in more volume. And so I think we could definitely get you rised in the ranks if you were to incorporate the three things we talked about into your online marketing plan, which were number one, more quality educational content with the right keywords. Number two, you want some more citations to get you ranked on the map pack. And then number three, more high powered relevant backlinks. And so over here, I've hopped back onto Arifs to see the other competitor. I don't know why it just switched to, it looks like Russian. <laughs> but right here, it actually tells you how many people go on their website every single month. And so it is often actually 10 times the amount that this Arif tool says. But let's just say that there were 644 people going on their site. If you were, if they were to convert half of those into customers, that would be 332 new customers every single month. Multiply that by an average water damage restoration job at $2,500, and that brings it up to $830,000 a month. Factor in a 75% profit margin, and they are at $622,500 every single month. And so that gives you a good idea of what kind of revenue you could expect from having a high powered site and why it is worth investing into it. And so that's what I have for you for today. Hopefully you enjoyed watching this and found this video helpful. If you are interested in learning more, you can email me back or you can give me a call. My number is 714-975-5909. So thank you for watching and I look forward to speaking with you.